All right, so we've had a lot of people put up comments and send emails about how to clean a bag. Um, and so we're gonna make a video about that today. Uh, first thing is do not put your backpack in the wash. Um, do not do that. Uh, it will destroy the leather. Um, this leather is super high quality, a very reliable, durable leather that will last for ages, but if you put it in the wash, it will destroy it. Um, this is not made to go through your wash. Um, the leather will just be destroyed. But uh, what we're gonna do today is we're first we're gonna clean off the bag and then we're going to re-wax it with some of these different uh, waxes that we have here. And we'll get into those in just a second. First thing you're gonna need is either like baby wipes or you can use like a wet rag and some water. Um, we also need, you're gonna need a, a hair dryer. And then there's a couple different types of hair wax or hair waxes clothes or fabric waxes that you can find on Amazon. That's where I found these. Uh, this one's called Otter Wax. This is Bull Hide. And then this one is called Mer Mertonixin Original Wax. We're actually gonna use the Bull Hide one just because it's a, it's, it comes as a bigger um, block. It's a little bit easier to use. It's just a big thing of wax. And I'll show you how to put that on the bag in a little bit. Um, and then you also need a hair dryer. So once you put the wax on to kind of smooth out the wax and spread it on the bag a little bit more. So first thing we're gonna do though, is we are going to clean off. As you can see, uh, this bag is, it's dirty. We've had it for a while, it's dirty up here. So we'll start by cleaning it off first with the, um, with just the wipes. Just take a minute, just So some areas where the, uh, I think up in here where it's too dirty, I'm gonna use the, uh, it's not really coming out with the wipe. I'm gonna use my, my dish rag here and just really dig into it. I'm just gonna focus on the front part here of the bag uh, to kind of give you a quick tutorial on it. So as you can see, we really, uh, just really, just got it, this part of the bag, it's really wet right now. So we'll need to, um, I'm gonna dry it and then we'll turn it back on when it's ready to be waxed. At this point, our bag is dry and we're going to put on the wax. Um, first thing we need to do is soften up the wax. So what I like to do is use a hair dryer. Um, put it on high. And you don't need a... You don't need to do this for a long time, just enough to kind of get it softer. We'll go a little bit longer. Okay. It's starting to melt a little bit there. You'll see. But so it's softened up. And now you're gonna Rub it on the bag. Try not to get it on the leather. You got... It's actually, holding the wax in your hand is not a great idea. That's why I have these great paper things. <laughs> My hand got a bunch of wax on it, but holding the paper thing, spread the wax on the bag. Make sure you, you can always clean the wax off the leather, but it's better to avoid it. So you got the wax on. Um, after you apply the wax, take a hair dryer and we're gonna we're gonna blow dry it to make it really warm, and then we're gonna use a sock to even it out and get the excess wax off. Mm -hmm. 
As you can see, the wax is really absorbed into the fabric really well when you warm it up. So just take a sock, you can take a napkin, uh, whatever, old shirt, and uh, clean off any excess wax, like here by the logo, up here by the zipper, rub it down. As you can see, there's a little couple couple spots down here that need to kind of be some up here too. A little bit more drier, a little bit more hair dryer. And uh, there you go. Your bag is clean, it has what, a new wax on it. Um, and you can put as many layers of wax on it. I'll probably put another layer or two on this to get it, to get it nice and, um, you know, a nice layer on there. This will help keep your bag weatherproof and, and, you know, keep the life, extend the life of your bag. So if you have any questions, hit us up in the DMs or shoot us an email. Let us know what you think. Thanks.